Hey there guys, I'm Jesse Crow, the Travelling Scientist, and today we're going to be looking at gluten intolerance and celiac disease, answering three key questions. What are these conditions? How can we deal with them? And is it possible to cure them? Celiac disease is an autoimmune disease. Word of the day! Auto, meaning self. Autoimmunity is when your immune system attacks your own body. In people with celiac disease, the gut becomes sensitive to gluten, which is found in foods like beer, bread, chips, cereals, and sauces, things like that. If you consume anything that contains gluten, your body will produce an immune response in which the T cells attack your gut and the B cells produce antibodies against gluten, which leads to intestinal inflammation and reduces your body's ability to absorb nutrients from food. This can make you feel bloated, it can make your stomach really hurt, it can even give you diarrhea. So, it makes you crap, and it makes you feel like crap. Approximately 1 in 100 people have celiac disease. It's currently an incurable disease, which is caused by a number of factors, including your genetics, the bacteria in your gut, and also the kinds of food you were fed when you were growing up. If you have the genes that are common in celiac people, that's HLA-DQ2 and HLA-DQ8, it's kind of like gluten stole your intestines high school girlfriend. And your intestines never really forgave gluten. So whenever gluten comes around, your intestines kind of swell up and act like a dick to make gluten feel bad. But it also leaves your gut feeling really bad and you can't really function properly. So celiac disease is kind of like your gut hating on gluten. Does that make sense? Gluten sensitivity is slightly more common, affecting around 5 to 10% of people. And it's defined by having similar symptoms to celiac disease, but it doesn't have such a severe immune response on your small intestines. So there's less damage to the gut, but it still makes you feel like crap. So if you have celiac disease, gluten can make you feel extremely sick and malnourished. But if you just have gluten intolerance, gluten's just gonna make you feel pretty average. So you're a glutard, what can you do about it? Well, gluten comes from grains like barley, wheat, and rye. And if you're a celiac or gluten intolerant, you just need to avoid these sorts of foods. There's no medication that can relieve the symptoms of gluten intolerance and celiac disease. So the best thing you can do is to just prevent those symptoms by avoiding gluten altogether. Instead of eating pasta, eat rice. Instead of eating normal bread, eat gluten-free bread. And instead of drinking beer, you can just drink spirits. Sounds good, huh? I know, that doesn't sound very fun, right? Trying to avoid gluten for the rest of your life? So let me tell you a little secret that might make you feel better. Scientists are currently working on a cure for these diseases that should alleviate the symptoms of gluten intolerance and celiac disease. And it's gonna be available to the public in the next few years. I'm predicting 2021. So that's gonna be sweet for you glutards out there. But until then, avoid gluten, yo. Anyway, thanks so much for watching, guys. I really hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, click the like button down below. And let me know what you think about gluten intolerance and celiac disease in the comments section down below. Finally, next week's video is gonna be all about the gut microbiome, talking about how our stomach can actually control our emotions. So make sure you subscribe for more traveling science every week, and I'll see you guys next Science Sunday. Cheers.